In today's tutorial, we're going to see how to create a 3D garden movie. Sir, Earth is rich in resources, but it's inhabited by primitive life forms known as humans. With the help of one platform which is called Plotagon.com. So I'll be showing you scene by scene how to create a complete movie. And at the end, I will also show you what is the earning potential out of such movies and lot more. So if you're excited, let's begin. Step one, go to Plotagon, P-L-O-T-A-G-O-N.com. And here is a site. You have two versions. One is mobile app and one is desktop app. Well, if you're looking for mobile app, you can choose it as per your system. But for now, I'll be showing the desktop app. So go to desktop app. It is only for Windows. After coming to this page, you'll have to directly go to get on Windows, this option. Once the application is downloaded, you need to double click on this. And then you'll have to go to install to install the app. After installation is done, you need to finish it. You will get a verification code, verify email. Step two, create the story. So uh, you will have to go to chat.openai.com. Here, the send message option, you will have to type your storyline and create the dialogue as per your storyline. Go and click on this send, send message option. Once you open the Plotagon dashboard, this is the dashboard which will open. We will have to go to create video option. Here you have two options. One is only scenes and one is text credit scene. So for this video, we are taking only scene option. Here we will have to create our project. So first thing is we will have to take a background. So my next part is how to take a background. Here we will have to go to the scene option in order to add a second scene. So for the first scene, we will be taking a background. So for that, we will click on the scene button and here we have different types of background. For the first scene, I will just scroll a little bit down rightwards and I will take this command bridge option. For the second scene, I will again go to the scene option. And for the second scene, I need a different scene. I will take this corridor option. Now I will get back to first scene to bring a character. Let us move forward to the next part, which is part five, create character. For creating character, we go to this character option. Here you have different types of character in the gallery itself. You can choose any one of it if that matches with your movie characters. If not, you will have to go to this create character option. Here you have three options, male, female, or randomize, I will select male character. Next, I will go to face shape and you can choose any of the shapes. Here at the bottom, you have different colors. So I will choose my first aliens color. This is the color which I have chosen. Likewise, you have different hairstyle. You can take any hairstyle you want. Next is mustache. If you want, you can take for me, it's okay. You can even check eyeball color, eye size, shape, and lip color. This is gray color. Next, I will go to the next accessories option. Here, I will take one alien head like this. Again, I will change the color. Next is our attire. You will have to choose a suitable attire. And again, I will change this color to blue. And I will take the bottom wear. And then I will change the shoes color. Next. You will have to go to the speech bubble option to select which type of voice you want. You have different types of voice you can choose from here. Next is the name. You can change the name of the character from here and then do done. And it will be added to your gallery. Likewise, I have created two such characters, Zag and Zog. So I will just select that particular character and that will come here. I will select the character Zag and Zog and I will make them sit. Next step, select the camera style. For that, you need to go to top right hand side corner of this camera icon and you can select any of these style. You can go to this play, play button, you can play and check how is it looking. Next, we will be adding a sound effect. For that, we will go to this bell icon and go to this drop down of the sound button and you can select your desired sound effect. Next step, add a dialogue to the scene. So for that, I will go to this speech bubble and first we will be selecting the character. I am selecting Zhang. 
Automatically, the camera should be moving towards Sam. And here you can paste the first dialogue. So I'll head over to here it is showing Zog. So I will select Zog. You can select the way they should be saying the expression from here. So I'll be first pasting the dialogue here. Now you can go to this drop down to select the expression. Now once you paste, go to this microphone option here you get three options first you can play the dialogue to listen to it second you can record your own voice or do the voiceover or else if you're satisfied then you can simply go to this tick button and alternatively you can import any voice file if it is recorded or you have downloaded from any other ai based text to speech software you can simply go to import voice file and that will lead you to the hard drive so for now, I'm okay with the inbuilt voice. So I will go to this. Likewise, we will be taking the second character as well. So I will go to this speech bubble and I will select Zhang's character. And then simply paste it here. Now go to this drop down in order to select the kind of expression you want the character to give. Next is character animation. Now I will select the character once again and I will paste the dialogue for that character for that scene. And then you will go to this drop down menu in order to select the kind of animation you look for. Now we will go to this zing option and here we will be selecting our character and we will be we can give a particular action like handshake or slap shake and we can select the second character whom you want that character to shake. So this is how. If you want one scene to be moved upwards or downwards, then go to these three dots at the bottom right hand side corner and go to this arrow. You can alternatively go for downwards by downwards arrow or if you want to delete a particular scene, you can go to this cross button. The next is go to this export button and here you can go to this render this video this option here we have four types of resolution you can go for 4k resolution and then go to render video there you have three options export with embedded subtitle export with subtitle in external file and export without subtitle i will go for embedded subtitle and render video now when it is rendering let us see how much such kids cartoon channels and from YouTube. And once everything is said, everything looks good. This is the final video out of this tutorial. Are we ready for our mission to Earth? Yes, sir. Earth is rich in resources but it's inhabited by primitive life forms known as humans. Have you analyzed this planet thoroughly yet? Primitive, you say? What's their level of technology? Their technology is still in its infancy. They rely on fossil fuels and have not harnessed clean energy efficiently. Excellent. It should be an easy conquest, then. Agreed, sir. We'll initiate the planetary destabilization process immediately. Let's proceed with the plan to destroy Earth and extract its resources for our civilization. Let's go, Zog. I am all set, Captain Zog. But this is a beautiful planet. What do you think, Zog? Yes, Captain. That's absolutely true. I don't think we should destroy such an amazing planet. Let's go back, Zog, and let's try to make our moon as beautiful as Earth. Wow, Zog. We have reached the moon. So guys, if you like this video, please, please, please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And please consider to give me a like. One small request, please do share my content with your friends and family so that I can thrive in every single day to create new videos like this for you all. Thank you so very much for staying here with me. I'll come back with some fun tutorial next week. Till then, stay safe.
and stay legendary.